What's up guys, my name is Devin, also known as FBE, and welcome back to another episode of Footballers. In today's video, we're going to be checking out the newest visor from Next Trend, the Next Trend VZR3. Let's go. All right, guys, so here are the visors. Next Trend sent over 10 different versions of their VZR3. So first thing we're going to do is take a look at the packaging. Next Trend is one of the best in the game when it comes to packaging. Got a little Next Trend logo up here, nice black and white look. VZR3 football visor, some details at the bottom. Down here, you're going to see what color we have. I'll go through every single color we see here and then check it out on the back. Kind of tells you guys a little bit about their new shape, their new clips, some of the different sticker options they have, scratch resistant coating, a lot of cool stuff that we're going to get into later in the video. And then also a little installation guide as well but enough about the box let's get into the box boom all right so first thing we have is the next trend case cleaning cloth it does both the sticker should be in here as well let's take a look at the sticker pack so you've got all your basic colors to match these to your team so basically you peel these off put it at the visor tab and then you can kind of match whatever team colors you are and then they also have some more unique colors as well you've got like a, a darker blue royal blue gray pink like a brownish orange almost a little bit of usa action and then this nice baby blue as well let's take a look at the visor Again, it's in this nice case, and this is their purple version. Whoa. So this is my actual first time seeing it. You guys got a little look at the studio behind me, but this shape is super unique. It's got like a nice curve to it, but it's also kind of flat at the same time. This is interesting. This is cool. Oh, look at this. Look at this detail. The next trend embedded in the actual plastic of the visor. Give you guys a little view through it. What do you guys think? Looks good. Wow, this purple is unbelievable too. This is just the first of 10. We have a lot more to get into, so I'm not going to spend too much time on this one, but also check this out. This thing doubles as a cleaning cloth. How cool is that? All right, next one we're going to grab is this one right here, and the color on this one is going to be their clear version. So this is the one that's going to be legal in most leagues, pretty much all leagues where allow clear visors. Let's take a look. Bam. Time for the great reveal. <laughs> Here it is, guys. So it's just your, your regular clear. Nothing too crazy about it. This new Next Trend plastic shape is really unique. It's kind of like it's got a flatness to it, but also a bubble shape. This thing is going to fit a ton of different helmets. We'll tell you guys a little bit about that in a few. Super clean. All right, next one, we're going to go with this one right here on the right. So this one is going to be clear mirror. So this one you might be able to get away with in game. Um, kind of depends on the refs. Sometimes clear mirror kind of it appears as clear, so they don't really mind. You know, some refs can be real sticklers about stuff like that, but let's get into it. So it's going to come with a nice protective film. We'll, we'll, let, we'll peel that off for you guys. Here we go. Check this out though. So it's got kind of a nice mirror look to it, but then it's still clear. You can still see right through it. And then it appears, you know, you look through it. It's basically just a clear visor. Again, this next trend detail in the plastic is so cool. Let's take a look at these clips. These are new clips, I think. Let me grab one real quick for you guys. So they're, they're simple thumb screw clips like you see a lot of brands do. Um, so this goes... You know, this wraps around the face mask and then this secures it real tight to the helmet. So they've got their Next Trend logo. Pretty simple, but pretty cool. Got like a rubbery feel too. Oh, the logo actually moves. <laughs> That's cool. Before I put this clip on, something I just noticed is this hole is like longer instead of just a single hole. It's kind of like elongated and this is going to help it fit more face mask styles. On to this one right here. This one is going to be black. Ooh, that's exciting. Nothing looks better than just a smoked out visor, man. I see a lot of NFL guys doing that. You hear the cardboard cracking? Oh yeah, check this out. Just a nice classic tinted visor. You can't go wrong with one of these. Again, probably not legal, but it looks so good, dude. Jeez, this new shape, it's, it's growing on me so quickly. The tabs are nice and simple. The shape, like you can definitely tell this is gonna fit a lot of helmets a lot better. We are gonna drop a video on how this visor fits on the F7 and the Speedflex. So if you guys have one of those helmets, stay tuned for that video and you guys will see how good this visor fits. The next thing we're gonna grab is over here and it's going to be clear pink. Let's check this one out. That sounds exciting. A lot of these clear ones you might be able to get away with wearing, but it all depends on the ref, so I can already tell this one's crazy. Ooh, that is crazy. It's like the most subtle, but like noticeable pink. I know that makes no sense whatsoever. Look at the edges of the visor. That's crazy. This one is probably my favorite so far. This thing is sick. Let's see how this next trend looks. That looks unbelievable. Wow, it's a good one. All right, next one we got is this one right here, and it's going to be blue. You guys know I love blue. Let's check it out. Oh yeah, ooh -wee. this looks really good. Let's give you guys a nice view through it. So the cool thing about this, it doesn't really give like a bluish tint, but it appears blue, so pretty cool. And let's get another shot of that next trend. Cool, this one's fire. So this is the next one we got, VZR3, clear black. What? How does that even work? Clear black, huh? 
Oh, okay. So it's like a, it's like a, a less tinted smoke, basically. This is basically like your 60%, 80% visor. It's, you can still see right through it, but it's got a little bit of smoke to kind of block out the sun and look pretty cool as well. Yeah, this is pretty clean. All right, next one we got is gonna be in this back left corner, clear blue. These clear ones have been pretty unbelievable so far. But listen to this box. It sounds so good when you open it. So good. All right, oh yeah, oh yeah, that's good. That's cool. I forgot which kind of changes. You guys can't really see up here, but so it's got like a, it's super clear. Again, you can see pretty much right through it, but it's got this bluish, yellowish tint almost. Let me see. And then looking through it, what do we see? Pretty cool. Pretty cool. What else we got in here? This one is the second to last one. This one's gonna be clear purple. Ooh. Oh yeah, this is a good one. Super subtle, super clean. Yeah, that's, that's fire. My favorite part is like, if you look at the sides of it, you can see like so much of the, tin in the plastic you guys see that it's really cool i gotta stop getting my fingerprints all over all these these clips are really cool too Wee. <laughs> Wee. all right put this one here put everything back in the box i'll show you guys the stickers again in a bit and just like all the little details about the box i just wanted to unbox them first for you guys we are on to our final visor what we got here have we saved the best for last oh this is the mirror so this one's a gonna be a literal mirror you guys are gonna see all the details in the studio all right, here we go. Final visor. Ooh, you guys see me? Hi. Got to get this clear thing off real quick for you. Check it out. Yes. This is sick. So this is the mirror one. This one is probably the coolest. Again, look at that next trend detail there. See me in the back it's up and then it's nice and dark too. There it goes. Yeah, this is a fire, this is a fire. All right guys, now that we've unboxed 10 different versions of the Next Trend VZR3, let's talk about the details. First of all, we have 10 different colorways here, but they are gonna have 14 total colors by the time the season runs around. They're gonna have eight of this kind of clear tint, and then they're gonna have six of these more colored tints. We talked about it briefly, but they do come with two different sticker packs. So this one's got your standard colors, white, black, blue, red, yellow, orange, green. And then this one has some more unique colors. You've got like a darkerish blue, royal blue, silver, gray, I guess, pink, kind of this orangish maroon red. Then we've got kind of a USA flag theme. And then lastly, this beautiful baby blue. So a lot more options than the other brands on the market. And of course, these visors come with these. This is a nice little carrying case, but it also doubles as a little microfiber cloth to kind of get all that dust off in a soft way that's not gonna scratch the visor. When talking about visors, the most important thing is going to be the fit. And this is an updated plastic from Next Trend. This is their third version. And this one is going to fit pretty much any face mask with no problem. We've already confirmed that it fits perfectly on the F7 and the Speedflex. Tony's going to drop a video on that a little bit later, so stay tuned for that if you guys have one of those helmets. Something unique about these visors is that the edges of the visor are actually beveled, which is going to help prevent the sun from kind of coming in through the side and kind of distorting your whole view. Just to quickly touch upon durability, these are shatter resistant and they're also anti-fog, so these shouldn't fog up on you too bad when you're breathing hard. Now, just for fun, I have grabbed the VZR1 and the VZR2, so let's take a look at those and see how they compare to their new VZR3. All right, guys, so let's take it out. This is going to be their first rendition of their visor. This is the VZR1. It does still have this clear coating on, so I'm going to take that off for you guys. So you guys can already see there's a bunch of differences from the original version to the current version. First thing I'm going to notice is the lack of a center tab on the new one. Honestly, with a lot of new helmets, this tab right here kind of gets in the way and prevents you from mounting it to your face mask. The next thing is going to be the shape. So this is a totally flat design when the new ones have more of a bubble shape. One thing that has stayed the same is their quick release clips. Again, just a simple screw tab on the back and it is the exact same one. Now let's quickly look at the VZR2. This right here is their VZR2. You guys can see it has octagon tabs, a big center tab, and then kind of this unique shape at the bottom. And it does have a bubble shape. So this is when they first went over to the bubble shape, but now this updated bubble shape is gonna fit more face masks even better. And they also, again, went away with that center tab and they kind of just streamlined this top tab. When installing any football visor, you do not want it to be bent at all when you're applying it because it does mess up your distortion. And these have an anti-bend design. So when you guys put these on, they're not gonna be bent all over the place and you guys are gonna have clear vision. Now, as far as pricing, the OG VZR1 from Next NextTrend is going to range from 40 to 50 bucks, and the updated 3 is going to range from 50 to 60 depending on the tint. To wrap this video up, we're going to go through all the colorways again for you guys. The first one is going to be purple. The next one is going to be their 100% clear. Then we have their clear mirror, black, blue, clear pink, mirror, clear blue, clear purple, and last but certainly not least, clear black. 
There you guys have it. There's an unboxing and a quick breakdown on the new Next Trend VZR3. Hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, like this video, comment what you guys want to see from us in the future, and subscribe for more videos just like this one. My name is Devin, also known as FBE, and thank you guys so much for tuning into another episode of Footballers.